just gonna take you through Telephone's admin panel. So this is our admin panel, and in the admin panel, you'll be able to see your call distribution for the day, the hourly call distribution, where your leads are coming from, and what stage in the last 24 hours they are at. You'll also be able to see total calls, new calls, old callers, total incoming, outgoing, dialer calls. Total agent status is also available here. Uh, what is the agent on call on hold? Uh, total missed calls. So these cards are viewable. Plus you have a complete view of your agent's life status. Are uh, they online? Are they online? Are they VIP? Are they online? Logged in? Have they been idle for how long? And you can refresh that as well. In functionality is you're adding your segments. This is more for adding your category under which you'll update all your contacts for bulk emailing, SMSing and your dialer campaigns. Then we come into campaigns. Uh, we have voice dialer campaigns which you can select. Very easy to create. You can select a date and time, put in a campaign name. If you want to assign the lead to your agent for manual dialing, you can do that. Plus if you want to do an outbound calling, you select the type of dialer you want to choose, progressive or predictive and you'll be able to choose progressive is when the call goes out to the agent first he answers then goes out to the customer predictive would be when the call goes out to the customer gets connected and then it gets connected to your agent in predictive you are able to select the ratio based calling you can select up to five which we provide on the panel and any customized more ratio required will be chargeable extra you select the segment under which you want to create a campaign so there are 388 contacts and this will show you you select the agent group here first under the agent group number of agents which are marked and not actively working on the campaign will be showing up here so you select the agent assign the DID on which you want to start your campaign and just save the campaign and the campaign will be viewable like this as soon as you start the campaign it will be in a running mode you'll be able to see your campaign details on your page very much like this we complete campaign detail what is the record running record completed what is your scheduling you can have turn it on and off every day certain timeline you can assign an agent to your campaign and you can watch the call summary what's the total call it's call summary for the campaign so you'll be able to drive out logs and select the status and you can just filter the logs here you can directly regenerate a campaign again for a dialer. It's as easy as that. SMS campaigns, you are able to do SMS campaigns as well. Uh, you just need to add campaign. If it's a promotional, you need to select segment. And if it's a transactional campaign, you need to select the lead status. These lead status gets auto-picked from your LMS panel. And you add a campaign name, select a text message, select a template. Then from date, where do you want to, uh, if you want to select a form, you can select a form, you select a link, if you want to attach a short link, plus if you want to put in the variable value, that is where you're able to select. So like this would give you a variable input value, you can select name, if you want to choose any custom value, you can add a custom value and put it in the insertion here. These names will be auto picking from the panel of leads. Any link will also be auto picked from the link you are setting. So, all of that is selectable here, and you can actually shoot out your SMSs. Same way in WhatsApp, uh, you can select your WhatsApp templates, choose what you want to shoot out, and you'll be able to use the panel very simply. Any campaigns which get created by your agent will also be shown here. An auto approved campaign from any agent which is generated, which you need to approve. Will show here any completed campaigns are viewable here. And any declined campaigns, if you decline them from your agents, will be viewable here. With an SMS, you can also track the short link, uh, which short link engagement. Right? This is a link click report, which mobile number is clicking the link. Very easily uh, trackable. This view for your leads. This is last 24 hours. You can actually filter out your leads. Let's see for last week, last month, last 45 days. And you'll see where all your lead statuses sit. How many good leads, bad leads. 
you generated you can filter them by source multiple filters from multiple sources you can filter them by their status say if i put convert do not contact it will convert it and then i go into search and then i would have the do not contact list i can generate a campaign directly from here and it will be getting assigned as dial a campaign to all the agents it is assigned to already so an automated call will start going out to the agents within the lead you can actually see uh, what the status the agent put up as a disposition it comes as notes where they came from what is the name what is the number what is the user timeline any appointments emails files or quotations shared with them will show up here you can call them send an sms email them whatsapp them then you can also add a tag to them uh, if any tags are saved you can club your leads in a tag form any opportunity amount if you feel you want to put in market segment and a website for your client these all things you are able to assess managers are also able to reassign those leads to other agents so this is our lead management module where all the leads gets managed then in the sms we did show you there is your how you make a short links you create a short link here put in your link name put in your url uh, and we will generate a short link for you from within the panel we will also have a sms template in the approval process if you want to input the variable values on it on a pre sent sms you can add a variable value in the template itself and then we have sms logs this is for your in and out of your sms which i showed it out from the panel you can pull up any logs any sort of delivery logs sent logs It may be available here. All your campaigns, as I showed you, are all available here. We have email. Uh, within the email, you have a campaign tab, which I showed you earlier. Then there is uh, email log for sent emails, and then email templates. You can come create your HTML templates here. Let's say email maker, template maker. You can set in your HTML if you want to, and you can just start shooting out those emails to your clients. We do have a social media management platform where you need to add your brand under the brand your social channels. So we give you Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Instagram. Uh, off the go, you can actually have a media library through which where you can bulk schedule your content, your posts. If you want to bulk schedule on each platform, you can just select the channel and date and time and input for a bulk schedule. You can also schedule posts. Manually, where you are able to post from within the panel, select variable platform, then select your image, and you are able to post it and schedule it from here itself. Then we have the chat. We are able to chat on Facebook, WhatsApp, all the chats are directly available on the panel itself. Uh, it can be assigned to the agents in round robin, and there is a notification when the chat hits the panel. Then we have calendars. Any sort of calendar entries your agents are making would be viewable here, or they made in the past. You can have a view of their calendar whilst they are making entries. Or you could also create meetings for your people uh, as and when you require. Just from here itself, like there's a scheduled call which is already assigned for somebody here. I mean on Thursday, so any scheduled calls which they would set up. All the working hours will be available here. Then you have settings. Within the settings, you have DID routing. You set up a number of functionality. You have users. You set up your users within this. Then you can set up your users into your user groups. These are more like sales groups. Sound uploads, which you need to upload the sounds for approval. You have an IVR builder where you can build your own IVRs. Any DTMF input-based IVR builder, one, two, three, four. So all is available here. You can create an IVR builder. Click to call scripts can be generated from our panel. So more integration, you can add your products for your people to send directly via PDF. You have pre feedback forms you can make. You can create SMS templates for approval. Email servers can be added. Your email templates can be added. You have calendar configuration, LMS, LMS stages, LMS configuration in terms of automation, LMS stages in terms of that stages, uh, sales funnel, LMS sources, the sources if you want to add can be added completely. Header and footer for your quote. So then we have the email campaigns. Uh, you can select your email campaigns. You can shoot out emails just to your leads. 
we do not allow any outside promotional lead shooting as this happen to blacklist your email IDs and select any lead status pick up your template which you want to shoot out and choose date and time reply address send address send the name send the reply name to choose a campaign name and the campaign will be executed accordingly you are easily able to track uh, open rates delivery dates sent rates and also click rates if there would be any onto the email and you can also have a view select a filter of any status delivered or open and you can regenerate an email campaign very easily from here as well post the email campaign we have a voice obd uh, solution where you can actually generate ivr calls for lead generation or automation according to your ivr you select time and date campaign name select the ivr which you want to select select the segment where you want to shoot it to if you want to attach an sms you can attach an sms template to your answered calls and that can be shooted out accordingly and it's as easy like that you can see your running campaigns here if you want to test see what data you want to get you'll have a complete view on your data any sort of call logs any press ones you want to filter out any press ones you'll be able to filter those out as well so money extension one two whatever if you put on your ivr you'll be able to have a look at it your call summary campaign details usage uh, what's the call pulse which was used on the obd campaign you'll be able to track that as well so it's as simple these four types of campaigns which you could create we have a conferencing service you could create an outbound or an inbound conference from our panel select the type of conference you want to do select the number which is going to be a conference number select the members you want to put onto the team and if you want to put any outside member you can select the number and you can start schedule you want to send a conference sms pick up the template send the sms this would give you a code for the meeting you can schedule now or you can schedule for later select the time and date and the conference should be activated you will get the number if it's an inbound you'll get a pin here where you need to dial in the pin to get connected to the conference which will be sent over the sms automatically as soon as you do an inbound conference or if it's an outbound conference they'll be if they miss a call they can call back with a pin so we have a missed call service where you'll be able to track any missed calls uh, if you set up any number for just for gathering the missed calls any live calls will be viewable here on the panel uh, any queue calls will be viewable here you can select your call logs we have color coded call logs any answered calls as seen here any customer hang ups any sort of uh, no answers invalid numbers we have a view of all you can pick up a call recording you can play them uh, and you can actually have a rating system for the call recordings as well so you can have a call disposition if you want to see your setup manually if you want to see if you want to add them to a lead or you want to see a history with that number you'll be able to track all your history details call history with that number as well from our panel so we have a voicemail you can set up voicemail for after office hours if somebody is calling you after odd hours you can just pick up any voicemail listen to it if anybody left any voicemail for any business lead which would have come through you have call feedback this is your call feedback so the agent dispositions if they are here you can be viewable very easily you can see your agents putting in the right dispositions for your people then we do have a lead management module where you can set up your sales funnel according to your sales process you can have an analytical view of your lead stages which are converting the most which are dropping the most you can have an understanding about your ad cost to conversion you can have a deal wise value on which stage what deal value is there you can have an agent roi that what sort of spend you've done to a agent and what roi they have generated on cost to revenue basis your integration with facebook google uh, Google Forms can be integrated. You can generate your Google Forms web hooks very easily from our panel. Or you, if you want to get your leads uh, implemented, so if you are running campaigns on Facebook, your leads can directly be imported into our CRM. That's very easy. We have a other 
list view where getting tap where you want to give what access does your agent have uh, or what he doesn't so we have made it easy for the managers to just implement that from our man admin panel and uh, whatsapp templates can be set up we have a custom api module where you can create your own apis and integrate it wherever on our panel it's as easy as doing it from the front end we have a schedule report we have a call recording review form you saw it in the review form we could create it here and these are automation triggers which are automating your workflows certain values if you want to automate uh, for your lead calling smsing emailing those values can be automated you can block certain numbers not to call your business set up a call disposition set up a lead tax interestingly you can set up create your own facebook messenger script from within a panel which you add to your header and your facebook messenger would be activated on your website and can be connected to your chat via a chat panel this is for us basically so yep this is our panel this is teleforce there are many reports which you could actually generate agent adherences performance call duration call duration talk time campaign summaries ivr inputs availability activity feedback form reports every report you name it we have it and then you could also schedule reports which you want to send or emails in certain timelines so this is our manager panel Thank you very much.